Today's interview competition will take place on stage right in front of the audience. So you will each have the opportunity to see the contestants participate in a two-part interview competition. Each young lady has been asked to prepare a 30 to 60 second speech about herself with which she will address the, the judges. This gives each of our contestants a chance to show the judges what she feels makes her unique or what she prides herself on. The young women crowned this afternoon will become representatives of Gainesville and North Central Florida and as a part of their job, they will be expected to make appearances at community events, charity functions, and business promotions. For this reason, during the interview competition, the judges will be looking for the young women who are best able to communicate their thoughts and opinions with self-confidence and personality. So let's get to it, starting with our team. Let's meet contestant number one, Tiffany Whitley. Have you ever been told you had to quit doing something you love? While taking the sports physical, I was told I had an irregular heartbeat and my heart had an extra beat. I was no longer allowed to do cheerleading and had to go to the cardiologist at Shands Hospital in Gainesville for tests every three months. The reason my heart was as strong as it is is because of the vigorous activity cheerleaders do. The CDC recommends at least 60 minutes of vigorous aerobic activity a day. The high intensity level cheerleading offers promotes a healthy weight in adolescents and can improve cardiovascular health over time. Since being diagnosed with a regular heartbeat, I have volunteered at a cheer clinic and as a cheer, cheer coach for a youth league in my town. My goal is to let young girls know how fun and exciting cheerleading can be and also promote the great health benefit cheerleading promotes. <laughs> I'll be testing number one, Tiffany Lily. Confidence. Confidence is walking into a room full of people and turning heads in a new outfit, hairstyle, or pair of shoes. Confidence is putting your mind to something and knowing without a shadow of a doubt that you can accomplish your wildest dreams. Confidence is strutting your stuff on stage in a bikini or floating gracefully across the stage in evening gown. Proudly representing North Central Florida and here to prove that confidence is key, I am your contestant, number two, Lindsay Langston. Good afternoon. Coming to you from Ponte Vedra Beach, Florida, I am 17-year-old Lindsay Bettis. I am an all honors and AP student, currently focusing my studies on working to become a professional in the marketing department of an amusement park. I dance every single day of the week, whether it's at my dance studio, where I'm part of a competition team, or at my school where I participate as the captain. When I'm not dancing, I enjoy working with service organizations that are very close to my heart, such as the Best Buddies Organization and the Bridge Foundation, which allows me to throw birthday parties for the at-risk youth of my area. And I hope to continue making a difference as your Miss North Central Florida or Miss Gainesville Team USA. Good afternoon. I'm 14-year-old Brianna Lacani. I'm a homeschool student in the ninth grade. My interests include dancing, drawing, photography, and volunteering, but dancing is my favorite. I have been taking dance for the past 11 years and have been trained in many different subjects. If you cannot find me in the studio practicing, you can find me on many different stages across Florida competing with my elite competition group. I also volunteer with many different community service groups throughout my small town. If you can, in the near future, I would like to attend a college, major in business, and minor in dance and one day, hopefully, on my own dance studio. I'm your contestant number four, Brianna Lacani. Zarek Oya, Minyan Zeru, Shelby McDowell. This means, hello, my name is, in Russian, and speaking a bit of the Russian language is an interesting fact about me. First off, I'd like to say how excited I am to be here and have the chance to compete for the title of Miss Gainesville Team USA. I am currently a junior at Union County High School, and I'm dual enrolled at Florida Gateway College. I am on my high school's competitive varsity cheerleading team, as well as the varsity tennis team. And when I'm not, <clears throat> and when I'm not um, participating in activities in school, I am um, working throughout the community and setting positive examples. After graduating, I plan to attend the University of Florida with hopes to become a Gator cheerleader and then double major in mechanical and aerospace engineering. With the title of Miss Gainesville Team USA, I have the hopes to bring back home the title of Miss Florida Team USA. I'm your contestant number five, Shelby McDowell. Hi, I'm Hunter Slint. I am 16 years old. I am a part of the National Honor Society at my school, along with being on the board of directors for Alice. Alice stands for Alliance to Lead and Serve, and is an all-girls community service club at my school. The biggest highlight to Alice is the Special Olympics. It is beyond rewarding to see the athletes achieve their goals. I am your contestant number six, Hunter Smith. Thank you. 
we can now bring all of our team contestants back out on stage for one last look. I'd say it's obvious that we have a group of very intelligent and ambitious young women here today. We're here on the set of this year's Miss Florida Teen USA. This is so not your typical pageant. Think of Miss Florida Teen USA as more of a great summer camp. Make new friends, gain self-confidence, and represent your hometown. And parents, you'll like this part. A college scholarship from Florida Atlantic University for the winner. Visit our website, be our friends on Facebook and Instagram, or watch our videos on YouTube. Miss Florida Teen USA, making dreams come true.